I hope this is not going to come across as obnoxious. There's an old soul that lives that lives um, within me. So I think it would be very unfair to my higher power to really separate the two. Um, yes, I'm a person who's the industry who is very, um, who's flourished. So that takes me to a an urban kind of element. But being rural, I'll forever be rural. Well, for me, I've done locations, I have done studios, I have done almost everything. If you think about it, I've been around in the industry for the past, what, 34 years? So, <laughs> okay, I'm not that old, just saying. Um, there's not much of a difference. If I were to be put in a studio right now, I think I would still be um, okay with it. It is not about Tina at the end of the day, it's about the character itself. So, which means that as soon as I leave my home, my house, and I get on set, everything changes. Um, that's where the splits happens. Tina is left back home, the character um, emerges. So, um, there's not much of a difference. Um, be it you put me in the studio, or be it you put me on location, May still remains May. So, yeah, I'm happy. Let's go back a bit to season one. Season one, May Gumeda had a oh, serious, mega, gigantic split personality issues. Um, she was a type of five personalities in one. She was belligerent. She was, um, you can't say psycho. One minute she's okay. The next minute, you know, she changes, flips like a, you know, a mad coin. Um, bipolar. I don't want to say schizo. That's taking it a bit too far. But I mean, just imagine a person who has five different personalities in one. That is May on season one. Now, May Gumeda in season two. Things changed. She's introduced to her old soul, where you would bury um, those other four um, personalities, and now the main personality emerges because of various reasons, which I won't be able to share with anyone right now. There's a huge surprise coming. Um, it was even a surprise to me blooming writers, creators. Uh, it is the old meeting the current, or rather the old meeting the current and the new. It is past emerging back into life again. Um, hmm, without giving it away, how can I put it? History repeating itself. Resuscitation. Hmm, something that I've lost many, many, many moons ago being brought back into my life, which was a huge surprise, which changed almost everything that I thought I knew about me and that particular thing. So, um, let's leave it at that. Hi, I am Tina Jaka, playing May Gumede on Goldiger Season 2. We have moved to Ekasila, so don't you miss out. Monday to Friday, 8 p.m., only on A. Home, sweet home.